Hi! This is the continuation of a series of videos designed to give individuals information that they can use to prepare for a visit to a physician's office. The videos are designed to help ensure that the individual can ask appropriate questions of the physician and to increase the likelihood that quality care will be obtained. Rotavirus. Rotavirus is most common in infants and young children. But older children and adults also can get sick from rotavirus. The time from exposure to symptoms is usually two days. Infection can result in severe watery diarrhea, vomiting, fever, or abdominal pain. Vomiting and watery diarrhea can last three to eight days. And this can result in dehydration. Adults who get rotavirus symptoms tend to have milder symptoms than children. Children, even those who are vaccinated, may get infected and be sick from rotavirus. This is because vaccination does not provide full protection from future infections. Children who are not vaccinated usually have more severe symptoms the first time they get rotavirus disease. Vaccinated children are less likely to get sick from rotavirus. People who are infected with rotavirus shed the virus in their stool. People with rotavirus can also infect others before they have symptoms. Children are most likely to get rotavirus in the winter and spring. Infection can result from putting unwashed hands that are contaminated with stool into the mouth. By touching contaminated objects or surfaces, then putting the fingers into the mouth and eating contaminated food. Rotavirus spreads easily among infants and young children. The virus can spread to family members and other people with whom they have close contact. Hand washing and cleanliness are important but they may not be enough to control the spread of the disease. The best way to protect a child from rotavirus is vaccination. There is no specific medicine to treat rotavirus infection. Antibiotics are not appropriate because antibiotics will not help with a viral infection. Your physician will want to ensure that the child does not become severely dehydrated. He will direct that the child be given plenty of fluids. If the dehydration becomes severe, the child may need hospitalization for treatment with IV fluids. Here is a child with severe dehydration. Again, rotavirus vaccine is the best way to protect your child against rotavirus. Two rotavirus vaccines are currently licensed for infants in the United States. The first dose of either vaccine should be given before a child is 15 weeks of age. Children should receive all doses of a rotavirus vaccine before they turn eight months old. Both vaccines are given by putting drops in a child's mouth. Well, I hope this helps. Have a good day.